Currently, the number of women PIs is about 15% in the Institute. In the graduate school, we have more than 50% PhD students. There is a large pool there of excellent researchers that we are training and we are losing somewhere, so they don't make it to academic positions. The question is really how we can increase the numbers of, of women in science. I think one of the major problems of young uh, female students is that they don't see many examples. What I find uh, very challenging is to find the right balance. To combine between my family and my research. Being a mother to three children and trying to be an excellent mother and give them all the support and the time uh, they need. Being a wife, so I think it's challenging to juggle all those uh, tasks uh, together. And therefore the direct conclusion is that it's impossible to track, it's impossible to combine family life with scientific work. The only thing that I really want to tell younger women is never think that being a woman is a handicap for having a good career. Women are as talented as, as men and they can contribute and so I don't see any reason why they, we wouldn't see 50% of the scientists being women. The most difficult stage in my career was the moment I had to decide whether I want to go for postdoc to go abroad. I had two kids at the time, one of them was only one year old and, and that was, moment was, was very difficult for me. I have to find the balance. In order to try to get more, more female in, we started a program in 2007 already of supplementing postdoctoral fellowships with additional financial support and this has several reasons. One is really to help them financially, but the, the other aspect is also this fellowship, which is very prestigious because it's really very competitive, gives them a lot of motivation and, and uh, the drive to believe in themselves that they are good enough and they can make it. The secret of all this is really to bear in mind, I am a woman, I am a mother, but yes, I want to be a top scientist. At present, although there are several women in high positions in universities, but there are not enough women in top positions and top ranks at, in all the universities in Israel. From all the places in Israel, the Weizmann Institute is definitely the leading place. It has really great atmosphere, it's a beautiful place, a lot of resources, and I'm sure I can do a great science. My advice is try to follow your heart, try to do what you find is more suitable for you and be yourself a role model.